Hello, Collective. Welcome back to the platform. Welcome to the Ascended Divination Priestess channel. I am sending you all lots of love, joy, peace, and happiness. Many, many blessings to you and your families as always. I return to source. I return to sender. All negative energies and intent immediately and permanently. I call in on the purest of white light and pray that you stay only in the highest of vibrational energy. Okay. Whatever the enemy, <laughs> whatever the enemy uh, uh, stole from you, tried to steal from you, it is returned to you. All evil and negative plans of the enemies against you are dismantled, being dismantled as we speak. As I have said, uh, so shall it be. Judgment is final. Okay, let's do our tea leaf oracle. We have the saucepan. Um, so you may have some trouble coming along the way. And this is not because you did anything wrong. Um, this is because you have someone or a group of people behind the scenes that are trying to cause you some type of loss because someone has chosen you um, either as a work partner or a love interest. And they don't want this person coming towards you, but something will be taking place in divine timing. You will be getting this offer. So this is something that will be successful. What they're trying to do is put an end to it. Okay. You're, you could be an empress energy. Okay. Or this is how whoever is coming towards you sees you. There is something where there's a woman um, that is secondly obsessed with another woman. Okay. She is absolutely obsessed with another woman. Now, what I really don't understand is that there's a masculine in between this situation okay someone does not want things to go in your favor they're trying to temper with the balance being brought into a situation so and this is something they are doing together now she and the masculine but she and her friends her fake friends and families behind the scenes they do not want two people coming together so they're trying to cause some type of instability in your life they're trying to hinder your forward movement hinder your finances, hinder your work. There could be something where someone is trying to bring you some type of legal issues that they don't have any rights to do. There's some type of action someone is going to take that's going to lead to them going to jail, okay? And the people that they have working with them, this is absolutely a plan. They're a sick, malicious, jealous, and insecure female behind the scene is coming up with um, she wants to destroy another feminine so a masculine does not give her an offer or something like that. Um, I had a dream where a masculine came towards, not a masculine came towards, two people met. Um, and the energy between them were very, like, I don't know how to put it. Like, it was a, it was the same person but in two different body. Like, they resonated on the same frequency. It's that they could read each other's minds without even talking like they just understood each other on that level okay so this is like a spiritual union this is something that's divinely meant to be it was almost as though the masculine could feel the feminine energy and the feminine energy could feel the masculine so they were able to communicate telepathically uh-huh um it was something really like just like the emotions between the two it was just so genuine and pure like like it's it's not something i've ever seen before like we i know we watch the movies and we see people falling in love and you know they make it look all cute and stuff but this was something else this was like literally one being in two different like like they resonated like i don't know how to put it but i think there's a family that's aware maybe this masculine was dating a feminine energy in the past that he did not resonate with or he grew out of whatever they have going on and she's she's having a hard time letting go so this masculine coming towards you is causing her some type of discomfort she's not happy someone could be losing their shit behind the scenes so she's trying to cause some type of interference it's not going to go in her favor by the way with us starting with the justice card in the reverse um whatever she's planning it's not going to go in her favor what's really going to happen is someone is about to land themselves in jail and the rest of the rock rats they're bringing with them towards you they're going to end up with legal issues as well 
there is someone in this family or this group that's very tech savvy and has been breaking into people's devices or someone's device. Um, you may want to stop doing that because there's a trail. I don't know if you all think because you use VPNs and things like that, your IP addresses are masked and they cannot see it. There's something where you, you all are being looked into, you're being watched. So it's like you're watching someone and you are being watched. You're, you are investigating someone and you are actually being investigated. Okay. So everything you all are doing is being monitored. It is being monitored. Okay, everything, your your internet footprint, everything. So I don't know how tech savvy you think you are, but just know that you are being monitored, you are being watched, everything you're doing, and whatever this family member or friend of yours has you all doing is going to lead you all in some type of really horrible situation. So this could be a queen of pentacles out here acting a hot mess because she's not getting some type of offer. Um, they want, they're wanting to uh, temper with someone's financial stability. They don't want you elevating in life. So if you're supposed to receive a promotion, if you have some type of money coming in that you're waiting for, they're trying to block that from coming in. And this is illegal, by the way. Okay, so let's say like since I do social media, and you know I always use social media as an example since I do it. So let's say I have like a payment coming in from YouTube. They're trying to interject that. They don't want me receiving that or whoever it is. Okay. So that's something someone is doing out here. They don't want you receiving what you've worked for. They may have people filing false complaints and things like that. All of that stuff is being looked into. It's being monitored. You all have been doing something for so long. That's why it has ticked someone off. It's tipped someone off and they've been looking into you all. So everything you do someone knows who's doing it and you all that are idiotic enough to be following i don't know if this is a family member or friend whoever this woman is yeah honey you're you're you are lending yourself in high water yeah this is absolutely a friend group but the friendship is not even genuine these are false friends right they get together come up with these ridiculous ideas and they think they're going to succeed and at least to nothing but chaos and that's how it's always going to be. These people are jealous of someone. There could be someone in here in this group that's in the public eye. Or maybe this is who you all are stalking. Whoever you all are working with is someone that's obsessed with another feminine energy. But she goes around playing victim. Someone has learned how to work people's emotions, play on people's emotions so she can get from them what they want, what she wants. So if she wants you to feel sorry for her so you can work work with her against someone else, she puts on this really false persona and plays victim. Someone is not the victim. You know that Kevin Hart line where it says that it's not your line? Like you're not the victim. That's not your line. Someone is out here pretending to be a victim when they're not a victim. And she's, she has people working with her. People have been working with her. You may have people now keeping their distance from her because they're starting to pick up on something she's been doing or people just don't see the purpose of what she's doing because she's coming off as really insecure, someone very malicious, a bit of a bully. Uh, so people may be distancing themselves from her, but there's something where it's like her family's Remember, her friends, they are encouraging her to keep doing something that she should not be doing, and they're all going to go down together. So whatever you are, are investing your time in, know that you have legal issues coming in, and the relationship you're trying to block is still coming into fruition, and it's coming quickly. It is coming quickly. So there's nothing you can do to block it, and the two people you're trying to block will be abundant. They are going to have a family together. There's a masculine that needs some type of healing, but the Jesse Bell energy he's with has this kind of energy, death. She's like the black plague, okay? The black plague. He does not want, to, yeah, nothing but destruction. He does not want to be with this woman. Whatever you are planning to do as a collective, a karmic collective, <laughs> it's not going to end well for you all. You're being advised ahead of time to choose a different make a different decision because you're going to be experiencing nothing but loss. Okay. Nothing but loss. And then you'll have to sit and watch the person you were coming up against in the public eye succeeding. So there is someone in the public eye, like I, that you all are trying to destroy. So whatever you're doing, taking charge, coming to, 
towards them or full force. Yeah, you're coming towards someone at full force. You want to come in and cause them some type of discomfort, whatever it is. It's not going to go in your favor. Someone is still going to receive a solid commitment from who they're supposed to. Whatever belongs to someone, they're still going to be receiving it. If this is a financial payout, this is their work their income, they're still going to receive it. You are going to end up in the court system for problems that you should not be in the court system for because you're following someone around that is unhealed, trying to play victim, trying to make it seem that someone did something to them when no one did anything to this woman or a man. This could be a man, but with the queen of pentacles out here, this could be a woman out here pretending that another woman did something to her when the other woman possibly doesn't even know her. Okay. You, you all may want to make different decisions. Again, someone could be in the public eye. So whoever you're attacking could be in the public eye or whoever is leading the folks with the pitchforks could be someone that's in the public eye. And it's going to be really embarrassing because whatever you do, you may end up on the news for it. So you all may want to reconsider what it is you're doing, who you are aligning yourself with. I don't care if they're family or friends. Someone is leading you all down a very dark path and there's going to be no return. Something is going to blow out of proportion where someone will have to pay a whole lot of money out of pocket to whoever they are coming after. It's not going to go in your favor. Okay? It is not going to go in your favor at all. Someone's out here like playing victim. This whole group, whatever you all are planning, is not going to go in your favor. You all have been causing a lot of manipulations, telling people that someone did something. Someone is this way. Someone is that way. No. You may, you may want to chill because someone is headed straight to prison. Straight to prison. Okay? You're trying to imbalance someone's finances, someone's resources. Make them, have them out in the cold. Yeah, you want to cause blockages in someone's life. You don't want them thriving. So you're gathering up the rest of the rugrats, the ones that, don't, that, that are choosing not to think for themselves. They're set on destroying other people because nothing is going in their favor. This is the only reason you're doing all of this because you had a whole plan to destroy someone and it didn't go in your favor. So now you're out here getting desperate, trying to cause legal issues. You're going to cause legal issues for yourself because people see the truth about you all. Okay. So you can keep causing blockages and celebrating too early behind the scenes. Just know that you are being watched. The whole community, the whole friend group, you are being watched by someone and you're out here stalking someone how can a group of people be stalking someone one person you want to tell me there's no one amongst you all with enough common sense to say oh we shouldn't be doing this this is embarrassing no one this is going to be you all at the end it's not going in your favor stuck having the budget pinch pennies this is going to be you all so whatever money you have left you may want to hold on to it because you have a lot of problems coming in. A whole lot of problems. If you take action to go towards whoever you think you are going to go towards and cause blockages, this is going to be you stuck, trapped with a lot of money issues. You may want to think twice, honey. You may want to think twice. There's something, someone has some type of evidence on you. Someone has some type of evidence on you, okay? Somebody has evidence on you. So you may want to, you may want to chill. I don't know if this has to do with a King of Cups or whatever this is, or you're working with a King of Cups and you two have been causing a lot of illusions and things like that, pretending like someone did something to you, stole something from, nobody stole anything from anyone. I don't get the sense that anyone stole anything from you all. You, you're just in your ego. You had a malicious plan to end someone. It didn't go accordingly. So you're, you're out here trying to disturb someone's peace. It makes no sense. This does not make any sense. Okay? It does not make any sense. Here comes the Queen of Wands. This does not make any sense. You all have been causing illusions about a Queen of Wands. Lying, manipulating, playing mind games. You betray someone. This is what you need to be telling people. You betray them. 
This queen of wands didn't do anything. Someone is unhappy because a queen of wands is what? Independent. And they got their independence what? Fairly. Off of hard work. They don't have to be out here with their hands out to people. This could just be one of the person's personality. It could be an empress showing up in her queen of wands energy. But you all have been telling a lot of lies about someone. An empress energy, a queen of wands. And now you're burdened because things are not going in your favor. You have nothing but troubles coming in. Okay? This has to do with a connection. This is what I'm picking up. This has to do with a connection. You all don't want two people coming together. From what I saw in my dream, two people came together. They still came together. I saw the masculine telling the feminine. I heard the masculine telling the feminine energy. Yeah, they told me you were, you were something. So meaning they told him something that was not accurate. So he had to find out the truth for himself. This is a whole family doing this. And his family too could be part of it. This don't make no sense. This does not make no sense. This is an empress they're coming after. They want people breadcrumbing you. They want people rejecting you. There are people that are rejecting these people. This woman, there are people rejecting them. They don't want to work with them anymore. They want you put out of a home. They want you to lose your job, lose your stability. If you have a platform that is growing or is very, it is very abundant, they want you to lose that. They may be trying to have your platform blocked so that you don't have any income coming from that platform. I don't know what kind of maliciousness or insecurity this is, but this is above my pay grade with this level of hatefulness. This is above my pay grade. Or maybe a little bit too below. I don't know. But this here, the level of, in, of animosity I'm feeling in this read, it's a, it's, it, it, it's a, it, it comes with burdens. It comes with burdens because it's a full-time job. You got to wake up every day and commit yourself to this level of hate. It's a full-time job. They're way down. Meanwhile, you probably aren't even paying these people any mind. Some of you may not even know who these people are. That's the sad part. That's the sad part. You don't even know who these people are. This family is a whole family, a couple or something out here doing all of this. And you may not even know who they are, but they are determined to destroy you. They don't want two people come. You and this person could have a past life connection, the person you're supposed to be with. The person you connected with in the dream. And this is like the feeling I got in the dream when I was watching these two people together. Very nostalgic. They seem very familiar with one another. They said they had met before many, many times on a spiritual level and they were meeting again. Okay. So two people will meet. So there's nothing you all can do to block it. Two people will meet. So I don't know if he was dating this queen of wands or whatever this was, and she doesn't want to let go. Uh, you're going to have to let go there. I don't think he's giving you a choice. Someone has found their voice and they're moving on. I don't know why this. Yeah, he's moving on to start somewhere else. He's moving on and he's keeping his distance from you to put an end to this freaking cycle. Yeah, he's moving on. It's a whole, I'm telling you, that's the truth. There is a source. He's moving on. There's nothing you can do. I don't know if someone was with a man for his money or someone just does not want a man thriving in life. This is sickening. And this woman wants to take action to come towards another woman. But she's not coming alone. She's going to bring her friends and families with her. They're on some type of mission. Someone is a liar. There's a queen of wands in a community that's a liar. She plays victim. Someone is very manipulative with words. Very manipulative. She plays victim. She acts that someone did something to her. No one did anything to her. She may be saying that someone stole something from her. 
uh, intellectual property. I don't know what this is. Like someone stole money from her. Someone, someone blocked something. Someone did something to her. Someone cast a spell on her. Someone cursed her. No one did anything to this woman. Someone is just insecure, unhealed, mentally unstable. Yeah, this is this is her. I'm telling you, like this woman's energy is draining. It's absolutely draining and exhausting. How can you live like this every day? You need to go heal, but you don't want to because it's too much work. You don't like to work. You want easy stuff in life. So maybe the, the man you were with was your cash cushion, and now he's not going to be there anymore because you're going to be left out in the cold facing blockages. Having to ask for, for assistance, maybe even living on welfare, you may end up homeless. Yeah. Crazy. This is a queen of wands. That's this way. You're going through an ending, darling, while you're stalking someone still. You know what's coming for you. You know. You're someone that goes to a practitioner. You know. Nothing but disappointments ahead of you. Because someone is still going to be receiving good news about a masculine wanting to work with them. And you are a bother because someone is heavily protected. And the truth is out about a plan you all had to have victory over someone. Okay? This is a whole family that's trapped in their mind, facing issues. Because what? Someone is abundant. Someone is self, self-assured. self Someone is independent and someone is the God's honest truth. You know how you have women out here that say, oh, I'm an empress. I'm a queen. I'm a this. I'm a that. But you look at them and their energy don't give none of that. But then they meet another woman that actually gives that energy and she's actually the truth. She's actually the truth. 24-7. Yeah, it bothers them. That lets me know this man has been with a woman for a long time, pretending to be in the upright, pretending to be the ideal woman. And now he sees an actual empress and he said, oh, I need to go over there and go build with her. But it's not really that. It's the fact that you two have some type of soul connection and he's doing a lot of thinking. This man's probably like in his thoughts 24-7. Now, I don't know who it is. It could be a king of pentacles. It could be an emperor. But whoever it is with this woman, they're leaving. There's nothing you can do to stop it. This is kind of embarrassing. You have an ending coming towards you. This is the end of wish fulfillment for you. You being able to manipulate all of this is coming to an end. You're trying to end it for someone. You don't want another woman having wish fulfillment in life. You don't want a woman, another woman having... Uh, 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 stability, being content, being fulfilled. You are out here coming together to end someone's comfort. And it's going to lead to nothing but misery for, I'm telling you, it's going to lead to nothing but misery. You're nothing but karmics, toxic people. And that's what people are about to see when they find out what you're doing. There's something you all are about to do and it's going to expose you in the worst way. In the worst way. So there's nothing you can do. Yeah. You're planning on stealing. And you think you're going to get away with it. You're not getting away with it. You want to go and file false police reports. Make false complaints. And say what? Someone did what? Took money from you so they can end up in legal issues. That it's not gonna go like it like you like you think it is. What kind of nonsense is this? What kind of nonsense is this? There are actually females out here that act this way. There's a man that does not even want to work with you all anymore. He's moving on with his life. Cause he's realizing how childish and immature. Each and every one of you are. And he's like, I'm done. I'm moving on. He's done. What in the world is this? What 
one in the world. There are actually females out here that pretend that live this way. That's embarrassing as heck. I'm telling you, the truth is out about your group. There's nothing you can hide. Whatever injustice you are planning or you took actions to do, it's out. It's going to be exposed. You cannot hide it. And it's going to lead to legal issues for you. You may end up serving a lengthy amount of time or you'll have to pay a hefty amount. You're going to owe someone some money. There's something here about defamation, slender. You're going to have to pay some money. And I hope you don't think the institution you're a part of is going to be helping you pay that money. No, they're not. As a matter of fact, you may end up getting an institution in a lot of trouble and you're going to end up in more trouble than you can handle. Meaning you're going to owe this person you slender, you're going to owe that institution money, or you best believe they're going to work you to your bones to get their money's worth out of you. So you may want to thread with caution. You're, you're doing sneaky stuff behind the scenes and you think nobody knows. You're being monitored. You're being monitored. You're out here paying people to do something to a star sea. You're being monitored, darling. You are being monitored. You, you're trying to end this person. You want someone on a live. You say you'll be damned if two people come together that you done everything to make sure they don't come together. That's what you said. So you've been going out of your way causing mayhem, trying to end someone's work, their commitment, their skills. You don't want someone committed to their destiny, to their path. You don't want any, someone being secure in life. In finances, trying to get someone fired from work. This is this is what you've been doing, trying to get someone fired from work, and they haven't even been paying you any mind because people in this energy don't. They're focused on their pentacles. They don't got time for this nonsense. Who the heck is this mess? What are you in middle school, kindergarten? What in the world? You're out here paying people to, to come in and temper with someone's work. And you're disappointed because every time you plan something, it does not go accordingly. It never will. Now you want to take charge and come in to cause mayhem to come and fight. Girl, ain't nobody finna fight you. 911 is nothing but 911 away. You, 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 you're going to get arrested. You're going to get arrested. What in the world is this? I'm telling you, it's not going your, your way. You're going to be disappointed. This action you're planning to take to come in and cause problems for someone is going to lead to disappointment for you like everything else you planned. This is, so, this is a warning for you and everybody you have working with you. Your whole family, a whole community is not going to end well for all of you. Okay? You got legal issues coming in, trying to temper with someone because you're jealous of them, because you're envious, trying to cause someone an ending, right? So that they can end up in jail, burden. It's not happening. Nothing but a bunch of narcissists telling lies to block someone's new beginning. And they're still going to get the new beginning. Look at this mess. It's a whole community living in fear about an impress energy. It's a whole community intimidated, jealous of one woman because she's a powerhouse right here. She's a powerhouse. That's why they're afraid of her. Intimidated, jealous. You got to make it make sense. It never will. And she's still trying to come in to cause us to pick a fight. And she's coming with the troops. She's coming with the troops. Charge! Lord. If there ever was a definition of pathetic, this will be it. And there's a, there's a kink of swords. There's a, either a police officer, FBI. Someone is watching you all. You better be careful. He's making a list and he's checking it twice. So he knows everybody and he's confirmed everybody that's involved. You better walk away. 
You're all under judgment. After you take this action here, the final judgment is going to be made. And it ain't going to be pretty. I don't know if that's an FBI, PI, some police officer, but he's he's watching every last one of you. You're being monitored. You are being investigated. There's something you all did that tipped up the system. You thought you had a, a, a tech savvy person. Little did you know, <laughs> he'd been found out a whole long time ago. And they're just sitting back and watching you all take action. This last act, this last plot here is going to be the one that seal you to you, you all in. Okay. Oh yeah. This is the one that's going to seal your fit court case, court case. And the person you're coming after is going to win. They're going to win and they're not going to lose nothing, but you're going to lose everything. This kind of childish, immature behavior, I can't. It's just that little girl stuff. I'm 32. What in the world? I'm trying to imagine myself taking time out of my day, get in my car, go and drive to someone's house. To do what? Disturb their peace? For what? For, for a ding-dong? For a man? Girl, please. Please. You better think twice. Think twice. Go within. Because this here ain't what you think it is. It's not looking like what you think it's looking like. This is what it's looking like. Like you're bothered by someone that's not bothered by you. Because they're not even paying you any mind. You see, they have their, someone has their back turned to you. Meaning you're not even worth their time. Because you're on some little girl, little boy stuff. They have their back turned to you focusing on their what their dreams. Thinking about their future. And you're back there making a whole lot of noise, having a whole circus of your own, and they're just ignoring you. Minding their business again. Have their mind on things of high vibrations. Come on. That is embarrassing. You want to tell me a whole family, though? Not, not a one, not a two, not a three in the family could say, let's not do this. This is dumb. None? How much, how much more money are you going to spend to block two people from coming together? You've already told a lot of lies. There's a woman in a community that just lies for no reason. Just lies for no reason. And she plays victim. Someone will pretend like someone did. Like, this is one of those people that will sit and cry in your face and tell you how someone did this to them, someone did that to them. And the whole time they're faking it. Sociopath, psychopath, narcissist. Okay? Someone knows how to pretend. Pretend. And this is a woman that sleeps around. This is a woman that sleeps around. Even the man she's trying to... You're going to have to walk away. Even the man that she's trying to block, she's been cheating on him too. I don't know what the heck this is, honey. I don't know. This is that little girl energy that's... I can't get with it. I can't. I can't. I cannot get with it. Mm. Yeah, the truth is out, honey. You've been causing a lot of illusions about someone in the upright. You're jealous because someone is in this energy. This is not you. You got to spread your legs to get stuff. Someone does not have to. You've been coming up in my readings a lot. And I keep being told that's what you do for your money. You use your body for favors. They say you got a lot of miles on you. A whole lot of miles. The truth is out about whoever you've been lying about. You're out here trying to end someone. And they're protected. And you're burdened. Right? Because you're being kept out of this person's energy. They see right through this nonsense. Someone knows whoever you're coming after is very genuine. They're the truth. You may have lied and said that someone copied your style, your personality, your work. Someone doesn't even know you. Because they're the truth. And this is breaking your heart because, honey, you, listen, 
them ancestors for whoever you're coming after them play. They are playing Russian roulette with your life. They don't care. They will take everything from you one at a time. Just for the fun of it. Meaning, any, mini money more. What do we take today? Oh, we'll take your money. We'll take your car. We'll take your security. We'll take your house. And if after they take all of that, it doesn't stop you. Okay, we'll take your pet. We'll take your kid. Someone's ancestors, they don't care. They don't care because they know what you've been up to, what your intentions are. Because if you're taking charge to come in and try to hurt someone in them, oh, baby, no, my ancestors don't care. They will wipe you off the face of the earth, but they're going to do it diligently. One step at a time. This meant to you one at a time. So by the time you are leaving this earth, you will know to never... Play again with a queen of swords. Okay? Because if you ever do, it's death. <laughs> yeah, this is your future, dear. The whole group is not ending well. You're all under judgment. Okay? It's not ending well. You're all headed to poverty. I've been telling you all, poverty is the road that lies ahead. There's a group that watches me, so there's a reason why that message keeps coming out. Poverty is the road that lies ahead because you're all under judgment for trying to block two people from coming together. Okay? And whoever you're trying to block is going within and seeing the truth about the whole community. And he's leaving you all out in the cold because something has been illuminated to him. You all need to grow up. And he's cutting his loss and moving on. I don't know how much you all have left in your bank accounts, but you may want to chill. Trying to walk around and act like everything is okay. It's not okay. You're spazzing out behind the scenes. You're spazzing out behind the scenes. But you walk in public like this. <laughs> this is you in public pretending to be okay, but you are badass HIT crazy. Listen, whoever you're coming after, they're good. And that's what bothers you about the person because what? <laughs> I love this. <laughs> it said, no matter what you do, this is this person. This is them. Come, collect confidence, secure within themselves, not paying you any mind, nothing. And the whole time you're going through a tower. You thought you were planning a tower for someone. The whole group is going through a tower. The whole group. And every time you take action to do something to someone, that's how it's going to be. Tower. Whoever you hire to go and assassinate someone, off someone, do some type of black magic on someone, they don't want to be part of it. They don't want to be part of it. They have better things to do. They got better things to do. They got, be I'm telling you, they got better things to do. They see the truth about why you are trying to attack someone. You're trying to block the truth, block a new offer, new beginning. That's what you're trying to do, trying to end it, put an end to it. You said, before you get it, I'm going to end it. I'm going to block it. And the Most High is just sitting back and watching you secure your own ending. I said, no, 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 no. Let her keep going. Let her. This one is hard of hearing. We're going to let her color her face, color of her nose to spite her face. Let her keep going. And so they did. They did. They give you time. They give you time to fix it, to fix yourself. But you just refuse to grow up because you're insecure as heck. You don't have any control of your emotions. Your mental is all over the place. You may be borderline mentally on mentally are. You're unstable. This is someone that takes on other people's personalities. What are, what do they call it? Multiple personality disorder or something like that? Bipolar, this something disassociate. 
Honey, whatever they call it. You are a medical uh, 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 atomic bomb. When it comes to mental health, emotional, baby, you ain't nothing but a joke walking about. Listen, they're still coming together. <laughs> oh, oh, the lovers are still coming together. What did you think was going to happen? Baby, they're still going, coming together. They're still coming together. Source, source said we just wanted you to know. They're still coming together. Okay? So all the lies, all the rituals. Everything, the manipulation. I know you're living in fear right now because a masculine is still set on leaving. But he is. Whether he goes to whoever this is or he goes to someone else, he's still leaving. So you can keep doing the rituals. You can keep doing the rituals. They're not working. There's something where it's that people have been doing mental rituals. They want to take your memory away. They want to take your downloads away. They want to take just, they don't want you being mentally stable. They want you to be like uneasy, living in anxiety and something like that with the moon out there. They want you to go from being fulfilled in life to living in fear, not knowing, you know, what's going to happen the next moment. Like someone is out here trying to mirror another woman's energy. Is that if I, if I just pretend to be the empress, I am the empress. Uh, yeah, that's not how that works. The, the thing out here is that there's a lot of people that want to be what they're not. Everybody wants to be an empress. Everybody wants to be a star C. That's fine and dandy. You see a star C, you say you want to be them. You think you're better at being them than they are at being themselves. Listen to that and see where, the, where you went wrong already. But in order to be that person, you got to go through everything they had to go through to get to where they are. So you can't just jump in their shoes when they are, you know, they have the mansion, they have the car, they have the love and think, no, 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 no. When you tell source you want to be like that person, they say, oh, okay. Well, then you got to go, you got to start here from A, go through everything this person went through to get to Z. Okay. And if you can make it to Z and still be clean and pure at heart, then yeah, we'll give you that life. You can't stand the heat. You cannot stand the heat. You be tapping out real quick. You said, tap out. Most people can go through what these kind of women go through to get to where they are. It just looks pretty on the outside. It looks comfortable. People see you in this energy. You're all confident, wise as can be, right? Divinely protected and you're practical by everything. People see you. They say, oh, I want to be that. She's, it seems like it's easy to be her. And then they step in your shoe and they want to ha- tap out. And they say, uh-uh. No, 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 no. The source is like, oh, you sure? You don't want to be them anymore? Oh, what had happened? What had happened? See, someone had to go through a lot to get to here. That's what people don't understand when they're out here trying to be other people, pretending to be other people. It's the trials and tribulations they had to go through to get to where they are. That's the part everybody wants to skip. You can't skip that part, Sally. You can't skip that part, Melissa, Elizabeth, Kathy. You can't skip it. You got to go through the whole process. As part of the reason on my channel, I let you all know I don't like anything that comes too quick, too quick, and too easy. I need to know what happened from A to Z. How did I get from A to B? So in case I ever have to digress, I know exactly what to do to get from A to B again. Okay? But you can't be out here skipping steps wanting to be, the, be like other people. So every time you say you want to be another person... That's exactly what you're telling source. I want to go through exactly what this person went through to get to where they are. Okay? Okay? But these kind of vain women? Nah, 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 nah. Nah. I'm telling you. 
There's half a one to be out here fighting people because the truth is exposed. She wants to take some type of impulsive action, come towards a woman with her friends, her fake friends that don't aren't really friends. Okay? And you know what? It's gonna lead to nothing but burdens. I'm telling you, nothing but burdens. Because someone, I, I don't know who you think you're coming towards. You may not want to do that. There could be a masculine watching you and just waiting for you to take action to come towards someone. And you're going to be burdened and having to move on real quick. The whole family, not just, not just, not just you, Miss Jesse Bell, not just you, Miss Professional Spreader, not just you. It's going to be the whole family. Okay? You all are being monitored. Monitored, monitored. And whatever action you take is going to stuck, keep you stuck. Like this is going to be you confined, unable to move, nowhere, losing money. You're going to have to pay someone out of pocket for defamation. There's an institution here. <laughs> You're going to have to pay a hefty amount. Oh, yes, for all the actions because there's a whole community involved in something. And there's a feminine energy that has been traveling from place to place, trying to gather up the, the, uh, 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 the folks with the pitchforks so they can come after someone, someone, a, a star C. Because she wants to be seen as victorious, like the better option than a star C. And she hasn't done the work to be that. Girl, and again, this is your energy. This is your energy. With this devil card followed by the lover card, you are reckless as heck. And you know what I mean. This is someone reckless as heck. You make poor decisions in love, relationship. I don't even think you can call it love. You don't fall in love. You're just there for S-E-X. That's it. You look good. That's about it. You serve one purpose and one purpose only. That's all you're there for. There you go, coming again. There you go, coming again. And the fact that you're coming with a group of people, from what I'm seeing, let, that lets me know you ain't nothing but a little girl. Because grown women, grown women don't need a pack. They don't need a pack. Uh-uh. Grown women don't need a pack. But even you coming with a pack, this is going to be you all. <clears throat> so you may want to think twice. The whole family. You may want to think twice because this is going to be yeah. Grown women do not need a pack. I'm telling you, this is going to be yeah. How are you going to gather people to fight your, your battle for you? I thought you were the one that's... <laughs> Listen. Whatever you're planning is not going in your favor. You're going to end up in jail for a long time. And you're going to end up owing, owing someone some money. You're going to have to pay every dime. If you're part of an institution, this institution here, oh, they're going to turn on you in a heartbeat. You're going to, you're going to be wondering, I thought we were family. Yeah, 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 yeah. You are family until you cost them money. Institutions don't like to be cost money. Okay? As long as you're bringing money in, that's fine and dandy. But when you start costing them money... Oh, 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 you start causing them money because you want to do things like this out here. It's a problem. It's a problem. So you're about to find out the hard way. You are about to find out the hard way. If the family you think you're in is not a family. There is no principle. They don't care how long you've been there. You're about to owe an institution a whole lot of money. And someone's ancestors are just sitting back and waiting for you to take action. And when they release on you, lights out. Lights out. You're about to be weighed down in ways that you can't even imagine. You will have never imagined that people could be that way down. Okay? Hmm. Yeah, there's an institution in here, okay? There's an institution in here. I don't know if there's a religious leader amongst you all too participating, 
There's a religious leader that lies a lot. There's a religious leader that lies a lot. And I don't know if this person is really like the head of an organization or they're just religious. Maybe they're into some type of religious practice, but someone is a liar. Someone's very dishonest. They have a lot of toxic ways. But they present themselves in a different light publicly. Someone wants to be seen as they're in the upright, but they're not. This is someone that's very toxic and karmic. Someone could be into like three ways and things like that. Someone's very karmic. Very karmic. It's alarming. And all these people are way down. Their energy is so draining. Man. Their energy is so draining. Like they're trying to uh, uh they're trying to interfere with a decision. Someone has already made a decision. What the heck are you doing? <sighs> Listen, I gotta hurry and get out of this. I can't. I can't. Clarify this eight of yeah, okay, there it goes. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I've told you. I told you. Whoever you are coming after, it ain't going the way you think it's going to go. It's not going the way you think it's going to go. Let me do my oracle card. Someone's going to be moving on with their life. And elevating while you're sitting in prison, rot, rotting. And the people you collaborated with will be out living their lives. Someone in a community. This is a feminine energy. Very vain. Very dishonest. She lies a lot. And she pretends. I don't know if someone pretends to be religious. Someone pretends to be in the upright. But she's not. She lies a lot. Like she's in competition with a woman that may not even know her, may not be paying her any attention. Maybe they used to hang out at some point. They don't hang out anymore. There's some type of distance between these two. I don't get the sense that they're even friends or were close friends. Maybe they chatted a lot or something. I don't know. There's something here where this woman wants to prove that she's better than another woman, but the woman she's coming after is not paying her any mind. Like some, like literally someone is off living their life and there's another woman just stalking her everywhere on every platform, wherever this is, can't keep the other woman's name out of her mouth. Like she just waits for people to mention you and she's off the road, got a hundred things to say. Someone has perfected their pretentious nature of themselves. They play victim very well. Someone will cry for no reason because they want you to believe that someone did something to them. No one did anything to her. No one did anything to her. Collective source wants you to know you're protected. You will be celebrating very soon. Okay? So wherever these people are planning, just know that you are protected. Have no fear of failure because you're not a failure. You're not going to fail. You are about to be abundant and your abundance will be protected. Okay? Mm -mm -mm. This cycle is complete. They may not think it is. It, I think they're in some type of denial. There's a cycle that's over, but they're still trying to keep it going. It's over. Like, people know the truth. The answers are unfolding. Come on. So the whole community that committed themselves got carried away. And now they can't find their way back to common, to common sense. And they still want to keep going and causing endings for themselves. Let me, let me get one more oracle card or two came out. Okay. About to go get me some sleep. Okay. Okay, we have three. It said, expression comes naturally to you. You are very skilled at communicating your thoughts through conversation and creative pursuits. 
You are able to get others on board with your ideas. I am charismatic. Okay. 444. Four, four. Trust your journey. Trust the way your life unfolds. And trust that you are where you need to be at the present moment. I am protected. I told you that earlier. You are absolutely protected. And you are where you need to be. Carried away. Listen, that's a man carrying a woman. Two people are about to meet. Two soulmates. They're about to meet. I saw that sucker in a dream. The whole scene. Two people, a man and a woman, got together in my dream. And it was like these two had known each other their entire existence. Like they could telepathically communicate with each other. Okay? He didn't have to say what he needed to say. She knew what he was saying. She knew what he was feeling and vice versa. Okay? Carried away. Let yourself be caught up in the whirlwind of a romantic moment. Okay? Unlock your heart. So some of you, maybe you've had hard experiences with the, experiences with the wrong person, wrong people, wrong men, wrong women. But source is telling you to open your heart. Don't close your heart off to love. Okay? Go forward. Oh, here's another one. Going forward. Don't dwell on the past, but focus on creating a brighter future. Manifest the new. Don't let your past experiences deter you from, you know, having fulfillment in life. Don't let it discourage you from having a new beginning, healing, and things like that. Because you deserve to live a fulfilling life. People like these, you got to kind of leave them where they are. You can't take everybody with you. Not everybody is meant to come with you where you're going in life. As a matter of fact, a lot of the times, most of the people you know are not meant to come with you. Okay? So don't let anyone have you out here blocking your heart because they've done you wrong. Not everybody is out here like that. There are still good people uh, uh, out there. You just got to do the work to heal and then source will align you with those people because of the vibrational energy you are on. You can be on this vibration wanting to meet genuine people. Once you do the work to come up here, that's when you start meeting these kind of people. Okay. And then we started off with the pot, the, the saucepan saying that there may be trouble ahead, right? There's the broom is going to be cleared up. So whatever problems people are bringing you, it'll be cleared up. It'll be taken care of. It'll be taken care of. Anyways, thank you all so much for watching. Stay blessed. I'll see you in my next read. Goodbye for now.